Hi, in this video we will discuss TLIP and XLIP. So there are two programs TELIP and XLIP. These programs are run by the shell scripts TLIP and XLIP respectively. Now what are the functions of TLIP and XLIP? They can read PDB and AMBAR prep input files as well as the AMBAR perm format parameter sets and object file format files. Now using LIP we can create peptide sequences and new molecules. We can link together residues and create non-bonded complexes. Also we can modify internal coordinates within any molecule. Most importantly using LIP we can generate topology and coordinate files for MD simulation. Now this is the basic flowchart for MD simulation in AMBER. Firstly we have to prepare the PDF file using PDF for AMBER. Then for the standard residues we can load the PDF file in, uh, load the PDF file in LIP and we can generate the topology and uh, coordinate files. For the non-standard residues, we have to use other programs like uh, Antichamber or RedTube server to create forceful libraries, forceful parameters and lit script. Then we have to load these uh, files in lib to create the topology and coordinate files. And finally, we can run the simulation using these files. So firstly, we will discuss tlib. We have already set the amber environment variable. So, uh, so this is the interface of TLIP. Now we'll create a peptide sequence. Okay. So firstly, we have to load the protein force field. So here we are using GBNEC2 ready for uh, implicit solvent calculation. Okay. Now to create the peptide sequence, we have to uh, type a unit name. Suppose the uh, unit name is PEP. So we have to write PEP goes to sequence. Now uh, we are creating a very simple tripeptide system. Okay. So uh, suppose the first residue is alanine then uh, glycine and then serine so alanine is the n terminal residue and serine is the c terminal residue okay now uh, we have to uh, save this structure as pdb so we have to write a command say pdb then the unit name then the name of the output pdb file Now we can also uh, visualize this structure uh, here. So this is the uh, tripeptide system. Okay. Now we'll uh, create the topology and uh, starting coordinate files. Okay. So we have to write a command: save amber perm. Then the name of the unit. Then this is the uh, uh, topology file name, and then the coordinate file name okay so uh, these are the two files that we have generated here okay using lib we can also get the details of any molecule suppose uh, we want to access this pdb file this uh, protein molecule okay so i have uh, already uh, prepared this uh, pdb using pd for amber now we have to load this pdb file in lib before loading this PDB, you have to load the protein force field. Okay. Now this uh, force field has been loaded. Now we have to load the protein file. So firstly, the name of the uh, unit, then uh, then the uh, command load pdb then the name of the uh, pdb file okay dot pdb so this file has been loaded now we want to get access of this protein molecule so we have to write a command and then the uh, unit name so uh, there are so many residues suppose uh, we want to get 
the details of this uh, particular residue value. So uh, we have to just put a dot after the after the uh, unit name. Then the number of this residue one six four zero. So these are the different atoms within this residue. Okay. Now suppose uh, we want to get details, uh, get access this uh, uh, this atom. Okay. So after the uh, residue number, we just need to type the na uh, name of the atom or the number of the atom. Okay. So so uh, these are the details of this particular atom. Now I'll discuss XLIP. The two programs TLIP and XLIP share a similar command language, but uh, XLIP has an additional X Windows graphical user interface. So this is the interface of XLIP. Now uh, XLIP has uh, similar kind of features as that of TLIP. We can load the PDF files in XLIP with the same commands, but uh, additionally we can visualize and edit the molecules using XLIP before uh, creating the topology and uh, coordinate files. So in the next tutorial, I'll discuss t uh, I'll discuss uh, XLIP with uh, more details. I hope this video is uh, quite helpful for the beginners, and uh, thank you for watching.